I'm Tony Chow, and you're watching Animation News. In this breaking animation news, Nickelodeon and the SpongeBob fans are right now in the morning of the loss of Steven Hillenburg, the great, the former marine scientist, and of course the creator of one of my favorite shows of all time, part of my childhood, and I still love it as an adult. SpongeBob SquarePants. He was 57 years old. But he started out on Nickelodeon, even though he he did not start out as a creator. He started out as an employee of Nickelodeon with Rocco's Modern Life. You know, worked for, he worked around Rocco's Modern Life. And yet, and then But before he did that, he was a marineologist. But yet, then he got a love for that. So he created in July 1999 SpongeBob SquarePants. But it started out at the KCAs with the pilot, even though, and that. I love Spongebob, and it's been on for years, and then in 2004, he, he created a movie, the Spongebob Squarepants movie, but then he left around Nickelodeon, around that time, but around season 7, but then he had made us return around season 10 or 9 and then at the end of 2015 he was part of the Spongebob Squarepants movie called Sponge Out of Water which stars Antonio Banderas as Burger Beard but now but now Spongebob will you know be part of them part of my childhood for now and forever and yes, the last movie coming up on the, uh, on the Paramount movie line is It's a Wonderful Sponge, which is a prequel. And I'll be looking forward to that. But, but it won't be the same without him. And it'll dedicate this in the memory of Steven Hillenburg. Or maybe around the new episode of Spongebob. I'll dedicate this to him. So, so Steven Hilberg, thank you for, for you know, bringing the sponge to life and influencing this to the whole generation of children. As you know, and who lived, who lives in a pineapple under sea? SpongeBob SquarePants. But who's the guy that created this show? Steven Hillenburg. I'm telling y'all, thank you for watching this unfortunate breaking animation news.